watching this interview with Kathy Hughes. Uh, she was interviewing Denzel Washington, and he was talking about his career. And uh, he made a statement that really stuck with me. Uh, he said that luck is when preparation meets opportunity. And uh, that really became a theme of my life because I'm still waiting for that opportunity. I mean, that real opportunity that becomes, that puts me in a place that I want to be. So that, that saying really stuck with me. I mean, pretty much half of my life, I've been preparing for the opportunity of being one of the great recording artists. Take the hat off and pop, pop and take the hat off. Everybody ready? Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna do it a little something uh, like this. Come I on. wanted to talk about Michael Jackson. Um, I'm influenced by a lot of artists. Very influenced by Stevie Wonder, Marvin Gaye, uh, Prince, um, and uh, James Brown. And I'm very influenced by Michael Jackson. Um, as a kid, Michael Jackson, not, not just for me, but for a lot of people, was somebody who actually sparked an interest in singing and performing. And um, a lot of times I, I, I look to Michael Jackson because he reached a level that a lot of people didn't reach and will never reach, you know what I mean, uh, in his craft. Now, don't get me wrong, I am not trying to be Michael Jackson. I don't want to be Michael Jackson. I want to be Rico Robinson, and I want to be the best Rico Robinson I can be. But in trying to be great and in trying to find things, I find myself looking at him a lot. Uh, some, of, some of the things, you know, I study Michael Jackson, I study Stevie Wonder, I study these artists, and I look for things that they did. What was their routine? What was their weekly routine? Who was around? You know, what things did they do that got them to that point? You know, um, how did they rehearse? Those are the things that I try to find that I can add on to myself and make myself a, a, a better artist. This week, uh, I met up with a talented dancer. Her name is uh, Denise Renee. So, let's go back to the Denise thing you said. Her name is Denise Renee. Stage name, Denise Renee. Uh -huh. Her whole name, Denise Renee Rose. Okay. Yeah. And me and her sat down about being a part of my show. And I basically told her about, you know, my ideas for the show and how I wanted the show to be and what I expected out of the show. And we had a great conversation. And we vibed, the vibe was great. And she's very talented and she has a great personality. And I'm excited about her being a part of uh, my live act. So I can't wait to perform with her and to start rehearsals. calls me one day, he's like, man, I'm working on a project. I want to come and uh, see what you got. So I'm like, okay, all right, cool. And uh, he comes by and he's just picking through tracks. So the next time I came in, he was playing some tracks for me and I heard this track. And now when I, at this point, when I listen to a track, I hear the whole song on it. And I wouldn't actually record a song unless I could hear the song immediately. So uh, this is how I work with other producers, not myself, because when I'm producing, I control the musical aspect of it. But if somebody's playing tracks for me that they produce, if I don't hear the song immediately, I don't record it because I want I want the, the, uh, the audience to get the best song. As Rico is picking through tracks, I'm watching Rico almost write the songs and the concepts right in his head. He's listening to beats, he's like, okay, turn it up. He's getting the grooving. Turn to the next track, he's grooving. Go to the next track, he's grooving. Go back to that very first track, and it's like he just zones out. He goes to the first one, he hears a couple things, he goes back, zones out, goes to the first one, it's a done deal. He gets in there, writes a song, he almost kind of freestyles the verse in the booth, you know, he's just kind of doing it. And I just remember thinking to myself, like, this dude is amazing. Immediately I said, okay, I started writing, 
and I wrote the song called Miss My Girl. And uh, Miss My Girl pretty much changed the whole axis of my album. It changed the whole sound of my album because everything I was doing before kind of sounded a little different. And when I did Miss My Girl, it just changed everything. And me and him had a definite uh, vibe and connection and the chemistry that nobody else had, you know what I'm saying, with me or with him. And uh, so we came out, we did Miss My Girl, and uh, it was a beautiful song. And basically talking about uh, a girl who I was with. And you know what I'm saying, I happened to, I mean there's a lot more to the story, but I was with a girl and I happened to mess around with another girl, you know. And uh, she found out about it. And that was like the end of the relationship. It really wasn't an end, but it definitely was a big change in the relationship. Also, uh, maybe in the last couple weeks, I got a chance to uh, shoot for my video, Miss My Girl. Miss, I'm sorry for the lack of respect. Total low honeys in the lack of the bet. See, I messed up big and I ain't think twice about it. I knew I was wrong, so we ain't even fight about it. It's all on me. I did the first shoot uh, a couple weeks ago, and it was a great shoot. Me and Deontay Barnes, who's my cinematographer, cameraman, uh, we got a chance to uh, get a lot of great shots out of DC because you know I represent DC, so I, I like to show actual DC in the background, you know, and let people know that you know, I'm from here. And I want them to see DC in my videos. I want to send a shout out to all my people, you know, who I grew up with, who I went to school with, uh, all my fans. To go out and buy my album pieces. Uh, it's a great album. I worked very hard on there. And uh, you get to see a side of, of me and a portion of my life in that album. So, it's 10 great songs. Uh, and I, I know you love it, so make sure you go buy it. It's on iTunes, you just go into the search button, and uh, you get my new album. I don't care which friends say I will always be this way.